what's going on guys welcome back to the swill entertainment channel all right so this episode we're gonna be playing clash of kings all right so i want to give a shout out to matthew jr so if you guys looked at the intro video on this video you guys are gonna notice that it's changed all right and that's all made possible by a guy named matthew jr all right so definitely love the art that he's done definitely appreciate it if you guys are looking for some art for him to make for you as well i'm gonna try to get that uh link so you guys can get um, in the description so you guys can visit his website and maybe he can make something special for you guys as well all right all right so as far as the base goes i am let me see i think i'm level eight yeah i'm castle level eight so we're making some moves here like strides and leaps and bounds in this game i'm actually liking this one better than the west game the west game is cool but i think this one is a this is a hair bit better maybe because it's been out longer um, the fact that you get a dragon and everything like that, which is really, really, really amazing. I like all of that. Um, now, I've been attacking people as much as I humanly possibly can just to get resources. Um, I just attacked one person and I lost about a thousand troops. I'm like, whoa. And he's roughly around the same level of range as I am. So his base defense must have been a lot better. Um, it's just one of those things where... I never, ever, ever do scouts. I just straight up attack. When I, I probably should do scouts because it takes long, longer time. So I need to stop being lazy and stop being very anxious and start doing scouts so I can see exactly what this the guy's bases have. All right. So yeah, word to the wise. Now that's this coming from different games that I play that are similar to this. Not necessarily this game, but other games. Um, you just you have to scout. You just I don't know. You just you have to. You want to see all the resources a person has, how many troops a person possibly has. I guess you can see troops. Um, some games you can't. Some games you just you just have to like go in there blind. Which, if it was real life, that's exactly how you're gonna be doing it anyway. You're gonna be going in blind. So yeah, pretty much it. Um, let me see. I'm upgrading. Oh wait, I got two builders going. I had to do my watchtower and I had to do my uh, I guess a military tent. Yeah. I did the military tent and the watchtower. So let's go ahead and knock out some more of these upgrades. Um, yeah, we definitely got to do those. So I had to definitely hire a second builder for 250 gold, which gold is not as hard in the game to get, but it's, you know, you got to be careful why you spend. Just be very careful. Know exactly what you're doing. Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and get this uh, stuff going here. Because I want to go castle nine. I need to get 10 so I can start using my dragon. All right, so let me see here. So now we gotta get our barracks to seven, which we're doing some uh, tro uh, troop training. So we need to go ahead and uh, just wait for that. And let me see, this barracks, actually not barracks, but the military tent should be done. Oh, seven minutes. All right, so that's gonna be done. So let's go ahead and speed that up a little bit because I'm actually, let's use that um, and finish it for free. So now we got two free builders right now. All right, so now we can get our our, uh, I don't want to speed that one up. I want to get this going here. Let's go ahead and get our castle. So military tent eight. Oh man, you know what? I still got to go one more to go. Jeez. That's all right though. It's going to take an hour. So we're not going to have that done until a little, little bit later of an hour. So once I get a break from work, I will definitely be able to do that. All right. So, all right. So we got another free builder. And we need to get our barracks up. Because at some point, we're going to have to get our barracks and all of our other things up as well. So you want to make sure you match everything with your castle level. You don't want to skip or skimp or anything like that. So while I wait for that uh, seven minutes to get completed, I'm going to go and see if there's someone else that I can attack. All right. We are not going low budget. We're going ham. Big time. All right. So if you look... Yeah, we are definitely recruiting on SSV. Um, yeah, it's only me and a couple other people right now. So we are um, trying to get more folks. And I think we're in Kingdom 1504. So if you want to look us up, 1504, that's where we're at, guys. So we're looking for SSV. That's us. Let's go ahead and get 10. Look at that. That's easy to get gold. Look at that. I got gold just by doing achievements. People always wonder, how do you get gold in the games for free? Do your achievements. It's you know, just complete certain quests, do certain achievements, and that's it. Nothing else to it, guys. It's just it's just that easy. So let's go find us a poor base. 
Actually, let me go back to that one guy where I attacked. That's going to be like a good solid three minutes. This guy right here is who we attacked. Um, I'm going to go ahead and attack him again. We didn't really lose anything. Well, we lost troops. We didn't like lose our dignity or anything like that. We just lost troops. That's cool. I can make more. It's not a big deal. I just want to get some resources, and I'll show you that report that we got from that. So... <clears throat> Let's see here. Where is that report? All right. So with that one, <clears throat> oh, see, I've been scouted. Well, anyway, I don't know which one it was. A lot's happened since then, so I don't know. Anyway, that's that's whatever. That's besides the point. All I know is we're gonna attack him again. Um, we're going to grab some more of the resources. We'll probably lose some more troops, but it's all good. I'm not worried about it. Um, let's go ahead and do our alliance donations, because you want to make sure you do those daily. Um, I get sidetracked really easily. All right, so we got to collect all. <clears throat> all right, so actually, no, let me go back to that, and we got to do our, our donations here. science donation let's go ahead and click on that one and right now they got the stars by everything pretty much <clears throat> um, so Grand Alliance is okay I want to get something that's gonna help us out um, troop expansion and Alliance defense let's go ahead and go with troop expansion because I want to make sure why is this guy going out in front of me like this Okay. I wouldn't recommend driving and playing the game if that's the case. I wouldn't recommend that, guys. Hmm. Not safe. All right, so we don't have... Oh, yeah, there we go. We got the resources. <coughs> All right. So we're going to go ahead and knock that out as much as we can. And then we're going to gather some resources while we are offline. And that's what you want to do, guys. You want to make sure you have... Set yourself up for success in these games. You just want to make sure you're good. You want to use your time wisely and use your, you know, set yourself up for success because you don't want to set yourself up for failure. Who wants to fail at anything? Nobody, right? All right. Um, you don't necessarily have to max out your, your deal because I know you max out like, what, four hours? You don't have to necessarily max that out. Like, I'm at 359 right now. If you want to do like a steady um, donation, I would probably do about three and a, I mean, I would, this is a theory that I have. Do probably like three and a half hours, and then as time progresses, that time does decrease. And that way, if you ever check your your device, your phone, or your tablet, you can just go ahead and start clicking, you know, periodically. That way, you're you're constantly donating throughout the day, because those people that donate um, a lot throughout the alliance, they they're the ones that get the biggest bonuses. So you want to make sure that you're able to donate periodically, and that's just a, a, a tip for me. Uh, I'm not sure if that's really viable or anything like that, but that's just what I what I notice. All right, so we're almost at this guy's base. Um, yeah, we're really um, about to go ham on this guy right here, you know? So let me see here. Do, 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 do. Alliance battle, that's me against David Lee. All right, so let me see if I can find this battle report because I know. Eh, maybe not. I know I lost like a 1,000. Well, here's a successful scout. This lets you know that the guy had. Uh, this is no. Let you know what he has. But this is a different person. This is not the person I attack, or I am attacking right now. Just so you guys know exactly what the, what you're doing when you scout. Siege victory. So I didn't get anything. Um, no losses. So we did get some resources from the guy. So that's good. So I already got. Man, that was quick. All right, so we didn't lose anybody. He didn't lose anybody because we already killed all the ones we had to kill. So he had 200-something, maybe 300 troops. I had 1,000. I lost 1,000. That's kind of weird. But that means his defenses are pretty good. So we just have to be very careful. All right, so we don't have to worry about when our troops come back, we need to um, heal anybody. So we didn't lose anybody. So that's good. We lost them all the first round. So that's cool. All right. Um... That's pretty much it, guys. 
yeah, definitely make sure you guys are subscribed to the Swell Entertainment channel. Um, you guys can hit us up on Facebook. Um, I have an Instagram, but I don't have the link for it yet. I'll put that in the, uh, the, the description as well. I'll start doing that. Um, also, you can hit us up on Twitter. Twitter is actually, I never really liked Twitter, but I'm starting to like it a little bit more now because I, I can reach a lot of people. Um, definitely like the Facebook page if you can. Um, I'll definitely comment you guys. I'm not big, I'm not big on social media. I, I have social media, but I don't use it as much anymore like I used to. Um, but I, I'm getting back into all that. So definitely hit us up there. Um, leave us some comments down below in the videos, if you will, and I will definitely get back with you guys. Um, share the videos if you can with your friends. Um, and let me know what you guys are looking for, because I'm trying to get, like, trying to make a big, giant community base as much as I possibly can. I like to connect with other gamers. Um, I, I've been playing online games forever. If it's not online, I'm not playing it, because I don't like playing offline by myself. To me, it's very, very boring, and it defeats the purpose. So, yeah, with that being said, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.